Paul here again from EMD Automotive at Canberra, Sydney. I've got this Porsche 996 I was working on this morning. Finally got the actual IMS bearing out. I guess this is the IMS bearing here. Um, this is the brand new one installed. There you go. There's another one there. It's a new brand new rear main seal using a special tool to install it with. That's the old one there. That's the old bearing. So let's go to the front, have a look. Okay, that's all you install. That's the new modified drive for the oil pump here. So let me take this out. All right, if you look inside there, it's a little hole on the corner there, it's hard to see. About there, let me zoom in. The tiny hole I put there, you see it? Right on the corner there. So what I usually do, I put on the corner that matches up the little slot on this one here. The slot there. All right, that little slot goes into where the little tiny hole is. You can put it anywhere. It still works, but what I'm trying is trying to actually make it work better by the lining put the hole exactly the same as where the line is for the little for this on the slot on the drive there so you just put it like that so it's like that so when you start the carb oil pressure will go straight into the IMS bearing from here shoots across oil will shoot across and go on onto the back of the IMS bearing here just to keep it lubricated at all times so it doesn't starve of oil okay so now I'm gonna put this cover back on now with the gear line up the gears the other one this one more goes here and we're gonna line up the front put that on and then that's pretty much all done and then tomorrow lift the gearbox pretty heavy this gearbox so we're gonna use the lifter to lift the gearbox up and then put it into the actual torque converter first into the gearbox Talk about the first into the gearbox and then onto here. Talk about the bolts go in and then pretty much everything on everything on top will start. I'm start building it back up. All right. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.